most recently linked on the uh, Linwood, California, catching up with uh, Eric Montragon, lightweight prospect. Eric, it's good to see you again. Yeah, good You're to back see in you action. Too. Yeah, Another yeah. six weeks went by. Yeah, yeah. You, for you're sure. on the on the fast track uh, this year. Yeah, thing, yeah. How's everything going? Everything's good. We're just trying to uh, get a good little rhythm going, like trying to fight every month and a half, every six weeks, just just to build that record, you know. Just, okay. Yeah. Tell us a little a little summary about, about your last fight, uh, Tracy Peterson. Uh, he was a very like uh, experienced fighter he was tough I was trying to uh, get the knockout but I, I just got to drop him but it, it was a good learning experience I, I definitely learned a lot yeah. I remember your first pro fight yeah you just wanted to knock people's head off with one yeah. punch man yeah, yeah. Did you know that's not the way yeah, it works yeah, it's, not, yeah. it's not gonna go that way no every no, fight. no yeah so what are, what's been the progress how, how have you been developing uh, your well my trainers are uh, you got uh, Martin Morales yeah and, uh, we've just been working the gym like just how to break opponents down and, and learn uh, Mexican style as he calls it you right. know? so yeah it's a different right. mentality so some sure. people would say that you're fighting guys with losing records yeah. but the truth is these guys have like you just said a, a vast yeah. experience yeah and, and you can just you know be that overconfident over these opponents because they will take you yeah. down the road and yeah. they, will, they will bring you down yeah so you're fighting Mario Aguirre again a guy with a losing record tell us about Mario Aguirre uh, to be on to be really honest I know that I'm gonna fight him but I haven't like <laughs> uh, did uh, my history on him but yeah I'm pretty sure he's experienced but I, I'm, I'm ready forever I, I'm ready for whatever uh, we've been sparring right there at uh, uh, Manny's okay. gym in uh, right. okay. so that's who have my, you been sparring for this uh, camp if you, if you could uh, share uh, that with me I've been sparring a couple like upcoming professional fighters. I had some of Manny's fighters, uh, some guy named Justin Gloria. That was a, he, he's really good. You, you know who that is? No, really no, good. I haven't been to Manny's gym oh, okay. maybe in about a month. Yeah, that kid is good, and then uh, just just different people come come from uh, everywhere in that gym. It's crazy. It, yeah. It's like a like like rooster fight. Like, yeah, right, right, right. yeah, it's crazy, but th that's what we need, you know. So it, right. we had a good training camp. Third time in a row that you get to fight a commerce casino it gets louder man. i, I yeah. enjoy uh, uh covering fights at that venue yeah, uh, yeah what brings the crowd out to come see your fight uh well i'm grateful that i have a big uh like following. big support and big uh, following so we're always like really deep but yeah, it should be good you know like it's like a, a, a very uh interesting uh, explosive fight like okay. i'm ready to uh, what are the chances of you fighting on a bigger card or another top rank card? Have there been any? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, we just uh, we're just trying to figure it out and, and trying to get a, a good fight coming up, but it should be soon. All right. Yeah. So first of all, taking care of uh, Mario Aguirre yeah, on yeah. August six, yeah. and hopefully we get to fight in another six weeks, man. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready to keep going. Yeah. Good, yeah, to, good see you. to see you too. Good to see yeah. you, man, ladies and gentlemen. Eric Mondragon yeah. taking on Mario Aguirre this Saturday at the Commerce Casino, you don't want to miss it. This guy's got power and he's uh, getting uh, better and yeah, better every time. Thank yeah. you very yeah. much. Eddie. Thank you.